Alrighty, Dan, six four three. Ooh. How can you six percent of a thirty second video? Okay. 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 Fine with Dan. Fine with Dan. Four twenty nine. Pretty good. Pretty good life. Go to my video, see how it goes. Press play. How can you six percent of a thirty second video? Okay. Okay, so it's working. Close you down. Open you up. Nope. Do this. All right, I'm gonna add some a video to it. Um, I'm working on my different screen. That's why you didn't see it. So I have video bins. I'm gonna, no, not import a bin. I'm gonna make a new bin because I have different kind of footage and I'm gonna call this close up. Uh, sh sh close up, I have close up, but I have um, pistols. And I'm just talking. I'm gonna keep this here. I'm gonna open up my thingy here to see if I have any thing coming up in the chat so I don't miss it. I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger so I see it. There we go. So now I can see if somebody's typing something in the chat. Alright, talking. I have a lot of videos about that. I think that was. That's the adjusting part. Um, I don't know if this is also in this part. Let me see. Or is this all in this part? Huh. Do I have. Oh, I have a long. I have a lot of video about this. I'm going to. Just gonna keep it open because sometimes YouTube is not doing the right things. So this is about pistols that I'm testing the different type of pistol that fits in it. Uh, do I want to change the frame rate? Yes, I do. Because I have no idea what it's what it's on. 25 frames. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, close up. That is in the other videos. Need this again. Uh, close. Uh, some fancy insert shots. Talking. I use the same categories in my... When I make my video, I use the same categories in my folders. So I know where to find my stuff. Um, and video. Talking. Because bubble in Dutch. There you go. And then I have the audio file. There it is. And it's also somewhere in this folder. Audio. And I have two of them because I have the part where I'm talking about the guns, uh, about the holster. And I have some... Hi, John. <laughs> Welcome back to a new editing video. I was like, I have to edit today. Um, I'm going to stream it. Oh, hell yeah. Otherwise, I'm just talking to myself in my head. Anyway, so now I can talk to people that are actually watching this. Or rewatch it. Because I noticed that some people rewatched it. I don't know if they rewatched the whole thing because that is way too long. But they might have rewatched just a little bit. And that's interesting. I don't know if people enjoy doing that. Um, so if people are in this part rewatching it, post something in the comments if you like it or not. 
Um, but yeah, John, um, I saw the thing about the the M4, uh, the spacey one. That's a funny story because that was a long time the only rifle that was allowed in the Netherlands to play with because it's not a replica of an existing gun. Um, and now I am uh, talking. This is not talking, right? This is pistols. Did I put it in this? Yes. 42. Talking. I can delete this. So I'm now I'm making a video about um, my new holster that I have been using for a while. Uh -huh. And for some reason it's really dark, so I will have to crank it up a bit. My light was not well balanced. Well, we're gonna fix that in post. <laughs> um, so now I need the audio to line up. Timeline should not be here. What did I put there in master? So the timeline is in my master thingy. That's okay, next to my folders. And now I need the audio part. The first part. Okay, man. Hold to the left. Yes. And I will just open it up. And that's the difference with the previous video is that I have only audio, no video with my audio. Because last time I used screen capture and then I have a video. And now I can, like I did before, I had to unlink it, but now I can just like really fine tune it. And I think I clapped. Let me see if I clapped. Yes, I clapped and I, I almost did pretty good, pretty good. That's not that cherry. I think that's maxed. Nope, maxed, yes. I think it's something like that. Now we'll check the end. Like, because sometimes with frame differences, it might not be perfect and as you can see it's not so I balance it out somewhere in the middle because we're talking about like milli microseconds or whatever one thing that I have to be careful about is if I slide over this one that this one gets shorter so I have to be careful that I don't like, um, like if I do this See, I delete some part, so we're not going to do that. But I think this is pretty good. Back! Are we? Yeah. Gonna make it. It has been a while, but we are back! Are we? Yeah. Well, it has been a while since I made a new video because I had a lot of shit to do. And, um, yeah. Finally, I'm back with a new video about something that I use um, and I will be using uh, more in the next year. See, that happens when you start recording a video. And I hate putting up myself in front of a camera. I always find things not to do it. And when I finally start doing it, my phone rings. Yeah, you can see my PGs. It has been a while. But we are back, are we? Yeah. Well, it has been a while since I made a new video because I had a lot of shit to do. And um, yeah, finally I'm back with a new video about something. All right. I don't need, I'm not Hello going to everybody. use that. Hello and welcome to a new, ooh, a lot of hands, a lot of hands. All right, I welcome. Hello and welcome to a new video. And in this, link it hello. First. And it has been a while since I did a gear video or something that I use for my gear, because I have been working on different projects. You might have seen different videos. I have to finish my Milson videos. I have to do a lot of shit. And uh, but yeah, 
I had to take the time to uh, I had to take the time to make a new video. Buddy, hello and welcome to a new. Ooh, a lot of hands, a lot of hands. All right, I welcome. Hello and welcome to a new video. And then this. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna keep it in. I tried to. Uh, I tried to do it again. Uh, but I have to be like spontaneous before I uh, start recording the video. But I think I, I'm, I'm happy with the second time I did it. I'm gonna start here. Oh, sh 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 use the magnet thingy. There we go. Delete this. Hello and welcome to a new. Ooh, a lot of hands. A lot of hands. Ooh, all right, and welcome. Hello and welcome to a new video. And then this. Hello, and it has been a while since I did. All right, welcome. Hello, and it has been a while since I. All right, welcome. Hello, and welcome. A lot of hands. Got to delete that. You can keep some funny in, right? Hello, and it has been a while since I did a gear video or something that I use for my gear because I have been working on different projects. You might have seen different videos. I have to finish my Nilsson videos. I have to do... Right, I need to change this first. I don't like that. I didn't do that before. Um, I always... Hold on, fuck. Yes. Now I can um, add some effects to it. Otherwise I have to, if you don't do it like the first time or at the beginning, you have to do it in every clip. And I'm just going to add this to it and I, I only have to do it twice it's like it balances out the audio if there are peaks it's gonna take it down if there is a little bit too low it's gonna crank it up a little bit it's like a multi-band processor I like it and then I can just turn up the volume up to six I think do a lot of shit and uh, but yeah I had to take the time to uh, I had to seven. take the time to make a new video about uh, some gear that I bought to use with my new pistol. And, and because I... Okay, I like that. Videos, I have to do a lot of shit. And, uh, but yeah, I had to take the time to, uh, I had to take the time to make a new video about uh, some gear that I bought to use with my new pistol. I had to take the, yeah, I had to take the time to, uh, I had to take the time to make a new video about uh, some and uh, but yeah I had to take the time to uh, I had to take the time to make a new video it's getting better and better without using the script but it's and, still not uh, perfect but yeah I had to take the time to make a new video about uh, some gear that I bought to use with my new pistol I think I did it again and, and because I needed and because I have a new pistol and because I have the new ICS XMK pistol I need it and because I have the new and because I have the new ICS XMK pistol, I needed a holster to go with it so I can take it to my events. And it was not an easy search because I needed a holster that was a bit universal because it had some weird dimensions, and I had two options. Still not comfortable without using the script. Still not. My events. And it was not an easy search because I needed a holster that was a bit universal because it had some weird dimensions. Hello, and it has been a while since I did a gear video. Isn't that weird that I'm re editing a video of myself, like you hear my voice constantly, and then you don't know when it's the recording or when it's me? Or is there like a audio difference in the recording or in, in the stream thingy? Video or something that I use for my gear because I have been working on different projects. You might have seen different videos. I have to finish my Nilsson videos. I have to do a lot of shit. And, uh, but yeah, I had to take the time to make a new video about uh, some gear that I bought to use with my new pistol. And because I have the new ICS XMK pistol, I needed a holster to go with it so I can take it to my events. And it was not an easy search because I needed a holster that was a bit universal. But I must say, recording this video was a- Some weird dimensions. And I had to up. It was, um, I felt okay with it. I, I did my, I, I, I wrote down the script. I, I, yeah. And because I'm usually a bit skeptical on the universal holsters, because I don't know if it will fit, if it will fall out. 
but now I had to do it and uh, it was a perfect time to make a video about it. So this video will go. <laughs> and is it hard to understand or, or like, I don't know how to say that. Can you follow when I'm talking and explaining things or when I'm like editing the video? Go about. So this video will be a. Huh. Okay. Thank you. Then I know that. About. So this video will be about the Swiss Arms Adapt X Universal Holster. And here comes my intro. Throw arrows out. I had two options. And because I'm usually a bit skeptical on the Universal Holsters, because I don't know if it will fit, if it will fall out. But now I had to do it, and uh, it was a perfect time to make a video about it. So this video will go about. And I tried to talk as slow as possible, but I failed. And as you can see, I'm recording and editing on the same day, or I have been wearing the same t-shirt for a week. Uh, yeah, Panda, um, I, I had to choose. I had to choose between the two channels, like you have Twitch, stream and YouTube stream um, and I keep using Twitch for my gaming because I don't want to mix it because I want to keep my uh, YouTube airsoft related but I think the best way to go is if everything airsoft related I'm gonna do it on my YouTube channel and if I'm going to edit videos about the things that are on my YouTube channel it's the logical decision to do live streams on my YouTube channel in my opinion but um, all the gaming will be on my Twitch. So uh, keep following me on Twitch. Have the notifications on. Ding, 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 ding. Put the bell icons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For a whole yeah. week. But it's, it's an awesome t-shirt. I got it from, I think Lisa gave it to me. Or my dad. Well, one or the other. And it's the... Skywalker and Son Land Speeder Service and Repair. Oh, I just love it. Beggar can Canyon Tatooine. I just love the t shirt. It's like Star Wars um, site merge. I don't know how to call it. It isn't from the, the movie, but it has all the links to the movie, and I, I just like the, the twist they give it. it. Yeah, that was. Uh, uh, yeah, that was not gaming or, or video related. Here we go again. Now, when I came into the world of Universal Holster, when I came into the world to the Universal Holster, I came up with two models. I had, you had, and when I, Wait. and when I came into the world of Universal Holster, I came out with two brands, this one and the, um, Warrior Assault System Universal Holster that I didn't buy because I went for this one. And in this video, I'm gonna tell you why I chose this one. And when I came into the world of the Universal Holster, Warrior Assault System, and when I came into the world of the Universal Holster, I came out with two brands, this one and the um, Warrior Assault System Universal Holster. Long pause. That I didn't buy. Because I went for this one. And when I came into right. Adapt X Universal Holster, and when I came into the world of Universal Holster, I came out with two brands: this one and the uh, Warrior Assault System Universal Holster that I didn't buy because I went for this one. And in this video, I'm going to tell you why I chose this one. Where I'm going to put my intro because that is a long thing. Hold on. Hello and welcome to a new ooh, a lot of hands, a lot of hands. Hello and it has been a while since I did a gear video or something that I use for my gear because I have been working on different projects. You might have seen different videos. I have to finish my Milson videos. I have to do a lot of shit. And uh, but yeah, I had to take the time to make a new video about uh, some gear that I bought to use with my new pistol. And because I have the new ICS XMK pistol, I needed a holster to go with it so I can take it to my events. And it was not an easy search because I needed a holster that was a bit universal because it had some weird dimensions and I had two options. And because I'm usually a bit... Too, 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 too long break. Options. It's gonna go.
got it right about here. And because I'm usually a bit skeptical on the universal holsters, because I don't know if better. it will fit, if it will fall out. But now I had to do it and uh, it was a perfect time to make a video about it. So this video will go about, so this video will be about, so this video will be about, oh, when I. Do you think the intro is best at the beginning? I, I like to start with something light and then like my intro. It's like two seconds of Frau Wehrschaft. This one and uh, Warrior Assault System Universal Hole. And when I came into the... And because I'm usually a bit skeptical on the Universal Hole story I because I don't know it if somewhere. it will fit, if it will fall out. But now I had to do it and uh, it was a perfect time to make a video about it. So this video will go about... So this video will be about, so this video will be about the Swiss Arms Adapt X Universal Holster to do it. And uh, it was a perfect time to make a video about it. So this video will go about, so this video will be about, so this. Hi, soy Kalyan KV. Welcome. I really enjoy your being here. Time to make a video about it. So this video will be about the Swiss Arms Adapt. You're new to the channel, right? Did I see you before? I don't know. Now I have to wait 30 seconds to know. X. Because that's Univer because that's the usual delay it, ca it has. Universal Holster. And when I came into the world of the Universal Holster, I came out with two brands. This one and the uh, Warrior Assault System Universal Holster that I didn't buy. Because I went for this one. And in this video, I'm going to tell you why I chose this one. Okay, this is first option to put the um, the thingy, the intro, and the other one is. Now I had to do it, and uh, it was a perfect time to make a video about it. So this video will be about the Swiss Arms Adapt X Universal Holster. Boom, intro. Oh, Gail! <laughs> Welcome, Gail. <laughs> How you so doing? This video will be and when I came into the world of the universal boom boom boom. So this Where video is... will be about the Swiss Arms Adapt X Universal Holster. There you go. Intro. Shit. I know what I did. Didn't I do it? Didn't I do it? I did it. I did it. Okay, we're gonna fix that later. Okay, somebody retracted his his comment. Um, not favorites. Where is it? A media pool, master. Uh, is it this one? Nope. Ars Alpha watches outro. No. YouTube. No. Hey. Ah. Haha. Here it is. Sorry, you're using the wrong account. <laughs> you're making it weird, man. You're making it weird. <laughs> yeah, I'll, <laughs> I'll fix it in post. Adapt. I try not to do that. I try to keep it as, as minimal as possible, just editing. And, and fix. Universal holster. Holster. There we go. Holster. A little bit too much time doing it. Holster. There you go. You're gonna keep it like that. Adapt X. Universal holster. And when I came into the world of Universal holster, I came out with two brands. This one and. Uh... Okay, now I can bring the other part back in. There we go. And I can start, I can keep editing this part. Now first things, I'm going to show you what's in the box. It's really easy. You just, I already used it. Panda, that, that's a really good thing. That might get the attention of the people watching your video till the end. I have to do something special at the end. All the way at the end. 
like the last thing that you are here will be my whispering words yeah <laughs> yeah Gail um, where does your name come from like if your name is Sai Kalyan Kave, where is Gale Wolf coming from? That's an interesting story. See, I'm using my chat to entertain my chat. Now, first things, I'm going to show you what's in the box. It's really easy. You just, I already used it, so I already know what's in the box. It's just, just to show you that it, it's in the box. And in the box, you found your holster. And also for me, it's easier if I put everything in the box, I can make it in the video so I can just tell you what, I'll, I'll, what I'm getting out of it. Uh, the next thing is the manual and how to adapt it. Hi, Connie. <laughs> Man. Damn it, the first thing is, I'm going to show you what's in the box. It's really easy. You just, I already used it, so I already know what's in the box. Just, just to show you that it, it's in the box. And in the box, you found your holster. And also, for me, it's easier if I put everything in the box. I can make it in the video, so I can just tell you what, I'll, I'll, what I'm getting out of it. Uh, the next thing is the manual and how to adapt it. Uh, but also, on. Okay, this is even cyber. Then Swiss Arms. I didn't know that they were working together. Okay, well, um, it's still Swiss Arms. Uh, it, uh, but also on. Okay. Did you know that Swiss Arms was Cyber Gun? I didn't know that. It, it, it was on the flyer, on the folder. I'm just going to cut it out. How to adapt it. Uh, but also on. Or do I keep it in? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. This is even Cyber Gun. Is that a 7 reference, John? And Swiss Arms. I didn't know that they were working together. Okay. Well, um. It's still Swiss Arms. Uh, on the back of the box, you have the way to adapt your... And on the back of the box, you have the way how to adjust your... <laughs> this is so funny when you see this now that I had, like, I have to match the movement to, if I cut it, that it's it's the same thing. Arms. Uh, on the back of the box, you have the way to adapt your... And on the back of the box, you have the way how to adjust your holster to... Let's see if it's still... Still Swiss up. Arms. And on the back of the box, you have the way. Still Swiss arms. And on the back of the box, you have the way how to adjust your holster to the pistol that you want to use. On the side, you have uh, shows you on how many places you can wear it, um, and some more information most used words in my videos and some more more information um i'm gonna put it here all right okay i might need to cut something because this is uh the next thing is the manual and how to adapt it uh, but also on okay this is even cyber gun and swiss arms i didn't know that they were working together okay well um it's still swiss arms and on the back of the box you have the way how to adjust your holster to the pistol that you want to use and connie how is finland doing um and or how it is in how is it in finland yeah that makes more sense some more information um i'm gonna put it here i need to cut this put it here. yeah right here so in the box you have yeah the plastic bag might make a little bit of noise you have two allen keys and then so in the box you have yeah the plastic bag might make a little bit of noise close-ups fancy close-ups ooh. Ooh, that's for connie eh? that's for connie ooh. Comes from my foreign friends, not able to pronounce it. Lol. There was an anime called Legend of the Galactic Heroes. There was a character in it who excelled who were mm. Okay, thank you for that explanation. Kalyan, Kalyan, whatever. 
scale. Oh, how many weeks did you have on your holiday, Connie? If I put it here, yeah, right here. So in the box you have yet. Yeah. Uh, we don't need that. So in the box you have yeah, the plastic bag might make a little bit of noise. You have two Allen keys and then uh, a small thingy. And you you have you small. And in the little bag there are two Allen. I tried to like shoot the B-roll stuff um, before I, I, so the process that I have is I write my line out for my script that I'm going to talk, no, first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to think about what video I'm going to make. After I made that decision, I'm going to think about what I need to talk about. Usually it's the same thing, like the price, the, the, the features, then I do my research about things that are online about it, things that my opinion are about it and uh, things that I notice when I'm using it and after I have done that I'm writing down a complete script like a type out of everything that I'm going to say and then when I have the type out I know what bureau footage that I have to make and then um, after I made that b-roll I uh, talk about the video I do I do uh, the, the, the recording of the thing the, the script that I have to talk about and then I edit it and then I launch it. So that's basically the process of the video. So it's not just sitting in front of a camera and uh, explaining everything. It's 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 a lot of work. But uh, I want to do it good. So um, so uh, Connie says perfect bureau stuff. Thank you. Um, I'm working on like a turning platter thingy. I bought one in IKEA. I have an old microwave uh, that I can use the motor. I'm gonna make a turntable like everything is gonna turn smoothly now I have to turn like with my finger on the bottom then it slips out and it's like <laughs> yeah it's not that fun I can you had four weeks uh, and, but I had it like one week vacation to work two vacation to work and one vac what four in total but had it like one week vacation that's one week to work that's two weeks or two days otherwise that's already three weeks and then two weeks of vacation and then another two weeks of work and well ah no i get it i get it one week yes two weeks of working another two weeks two weeks of working one week okay i got it i got it so you got four weeks but it's split up in a few months all right Gotcha. Plastic bag might make a little bit of noise. You have two, and in the little bag there. Okay. So in the box you have, yeah, the plastic bag might make a little bit of noise. You have two out. Okay. Might make a little bit of noise, and in the little bag there are two Allen keys and the uh, release button that you want, and the release button if you want to use it as the left hand holster. A release button that you want and the release button the uh, release button the uh, release button and that really. and keys and the uh, release the release button, and the release button if you want to use it as the left hand holster I can like hide this with <laughs> some b-roll footage that's why most of the people that make videos have b-roll footage like cover up the mistakes and the release button if you want to use it as the left hand holster Um, and some more information so in the box you have yeah the plastic bag might make a little bit of noise and in the little bag there are two allen keys and and the release button if you want to use it as the left keys and and the two ends and and the release keys and keys and keys and whoa what did i do what did i do keys and the release button if you want to use it as the left hand holster Replace clip. Yeah, we don't do that. Eh? And the release button if you want to use it as the left hand holster. But I really like the holster. I have been using it a few times now. I'm not going to spoil the video too much. Otherwise, nobody's going to watch it anymore. 
thing is the manual and how to adapt it and spring that's something that I already took out. Now the other things that are in this little bag are the things that I had to take out to make it fit with my pistol I took out. Now the other things that are in this little bag are the things that I had to take out to make it fit fit with my pistol. So those are the things that you get when you uh, buy it and that's what is in the box. Okay. Okay, now we got that part out of the way. Uh, I, I will just close the box to make Save it. Really important. There you go. Oh, we got that one. I know I struggle to get the manual in, blah, blah, blah. I will just keep it here so it's still in the. Yeah, that takes. Okay. The holster. I will just keep it here so it's still in the. Yeah, that takes. Okay. The holster. Okay. The holster. Yes, my script is to my right. This is, I don't know if you can see, this is my uh, written pages. People told me, like, get it like a teleprompter, teleprompter, telepro, whatever. The thing that reads your text, that displays the text, and you can read it then. I don't like it because then you are so focused on that text. And yes, I want to have it written out because my English is not always on point, and I tend to go away from topic really fast and then I forgot where I am and then I get really frustrated and in my first videos you can see at the end of the videos I get really frustrated because the things that I wanted to say were coming out the wrong way so when I have it all written down or if I have it all written out I know what I have to say and that I can say it and on a later stage I will switch to just keywords but I'm not in that stage yet Teleprompter. Thank you, John. And I'm going to start off with the features of this holster and why I bought it. Because now this one could be used on the left or the right side. You can use it as a tie holster. Uh, you can change buckles. And I'm going to start off with the features of this holster and, and why I bought it. Because it's a universal holster that you can use in a lot of different ways. And that's something that I really like. I like the flexibility of my gear. Now this one could be used on the left or the right side. You can use it as a tie holster. Uh, you can change buckles. There are a lot of options. And you can use about 200 pistols. So we're going to test that out. Like I, I know a few friends that use daily, daily prompters. And you can always see. And it's like the emotion is gone. The the uh, the passion that you put into it. like people that know me and, and follow my channel they know that I'm passionate about the things that I buy because I only buy them if I need it or I really want to test it and if people are reading a script like eh, 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 I don't know what's your opinion about it like do you care like it's like a newsreader that is just reading a script or do you like the fact that there is like emotion or um, passion in, in the thing that I explain? So we're gonna start off with the features of this thing because uh, yeah, I kind of like it and how it's set up and how easy it is to set it up. And um, let's see if, uh, no, no, no. And I'm gonna start off with the first one. It's a left hand, right hand holster. That means that you can switch the paddle or any other thing you want to put on your belt or whatever you can switch it to the other side what makes it uh, easy for the left hand or a right hand user or if you want to use two pistols you can have one on both sides you can have one on both sides easy for the left hand or a right hand user or if you want to use two pistols you can have one on the problem with putting the like the outline on it I think is if I have it next to my camera, is that I'm gonna watch at my outline too much. If it's on the piece of paper next to me, I like have physical physically have to move my head to. All right, I have don't I don't know where I am anymore. Um, otherwise, I will be doing I will be doing it while I'm filming, and now I have to move my head. It's like a big movement instead of moving my eyes, and that's one thing that I don't like. If you are recording a video, I want to talk to my audience. I want to talk to my audience <laughs> um, and if the eyes are like 
off center of to that's really annoying for the people that are watching it especially if you make a video that you talk about talk to the audience okay okay on both sides you can have one on both sides you can have one on two pistols you can have you can have two pistols you can have one on both sides you can have and I have to open up my mouth when I speak two pistols you can have one on both I don't know what to do with two pistols you can have pistols you can Do it like this. Right. So I can play around with it a little bit to make it. Two pistols. You can have one on both sides. Two pistols. You can have one on both. Yeah, the pistol is cut. Oh, I hate that. I didn't think about it. Two pistols. You can have one on. Two pistols. Two pistols. You can have one on both. That's why I cut off. I cut out the pistols. Two pistols. You can have one on both sides. Use two pistols. You can have one on. Okay, I have to cut one frame. Be gone. Then I have to check pistols. You can have one on both sides. I think that's pretty good. You use two pistols. You can have one on both sides. All right. That's good. Now the path. This was also not the hardest video to make because it's a simple thing. There are not that many features on it, uh, but I still managed to talk about it a long time. Over here, no, no, did I cut it? Yeah, I cut it. Connection. And I have to la I have to make a lot of videos about the gear that I'm using. Um, I have my belt here because I'm making a uh, first aid kit that can fit in my first aid pad case, whatever. Um, and this holster goes here. This is the the room for my holster. But now it's not on it because I made the video. Uh, but this is another piece of equipment that I want to make a video about. That's my IFAC or my uh, TCCC kit. TCCC kit. Um, and I also want to make a video about this uh, pouch because it's a really cool pouch. This menu tiger pouch. And um, yeah, I already made one about the belt. You can find it. And people already seen it, most of them. So yeah, um, I don't want to go in detail about like pouches and stuff. Um, or do you think that's interesting to know why I use the pouch or why I decided to choose this pouch instead of another one? Um, if you like that, just let me know and I'll try to make a video about the pouches that I'm using and why I'm using. I think one video about one pouch might be a little bit too much, but maybe like an over overview of pouches. Just brainstorming with you guys. Now the paddle that you can put in your pants, you can swivel it three. Now the paddle that you can put in your pants, you can swivel it 360 degrees. Uh, but be careful if you're an active player. They say yes, you can switch it to the other side. But um, a lot of the boots that fit fit the paddle on um, are gone because I have been banging it against rocks. I have been sliding over the ground, and the teeth really wear out pretty fast. So if you want to use the left and right and switch it around, you might uh, use something to cover the teeth up. Uh, maybe 3D print something that just fit over this uh, to secure the, that the teeth, to make sure that the teeth don't get damaged. Uh, to secure the, that the teeth, to make sure that uh, to secure the, that the teeth.
Ciao, 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 Yeah, I'm working on um, <laughs> that's the the video. What I run with is something that um, I'm working on because I I thought about that really hard and long, and it hurt me so bad. I asked so many people like, "What I'm going to do first? Like, it's the chicken and the egg thing. If I make videos about the gear that I'm using, I can't refer to videos about the thing that I'm using. But if I make videos about my gear first, then if I talk in this video like what gear do I use then I can refer to the videos that I made about that gear but the problem is that making those videos about that gear I'm I think I done in, in like the big error the big picture is almost done and then when I have that I'm gonna explain first what lines I use that's a video upcoming uh, what lines I use like uh, first line is clothing second line is my my belt um, uh, a and B, second second A, second B, that's my belt, B is my chest rig, uh, third line is uh, my backpacks, and then uh, fourth line, I don't remember anymore. Well, I have it all written down in my notebook, but that video is upcoming to show you what I'm wearing and why I'm wearing it. And then I'm not going to go into detail of why did I chose this belt. No, I use a belt with pouches to put this and this and this. And then I'm also making a video, I'm going to make a video about the stuff that is in my backpack, the stuff that I wear in my belt, the stuff that I wear, um, like the more detailed about what's in my belt, what's in my um, um, backpack, I already said that. So I have to do a lot more videos. Like the, f the big video is the line video. That will explain line one, line two, line three. And when I have before I can do that, I have to explain what's in my line one or what's in my belt. Because in line one, I'm going to say I'm using a battle belt to keep me going for so many hours. That's it. And if you want to know more about my battle belt and what's in it, you have to check that video. And if you check that video, you can see uh, I can like small uh, like shrink it down and and more make make it more detailed for people to know um, what type of belt that I'm using and why I use that belt. If that makes a little bit of sense. See, that's why I script my things. Because I go off track really fast. Uh, maybe three different something that just fit over this. Uh, to make sure that these don't get damaged. That, yeah. Uh, now there are 30 seconds of awkward silence. Because nobody's giving an answer. <laughs> And because of those 360 degree position of the paddle thingy, you can wear it in any position that you like, if you like it a little bit more. For the people that are not going to stay over to the uh, complete editing, I'm going to show you. I made a uh, close up of that. I don't know where it is. Not this. This. Whee! But I had a hard time doing it. That will be the overlay without the music. A little bit more. And now I think about it, I should have put music on, but then you could hear the clicks. Well, yeah. yeah. And if you can do that, you can just tighten it again and it's in an angle position. What is pretty cool. Now you also have some different options. This is the paddle version. You also have the one with the two holes in it that is just to go around your belt. You also have the molly thing that you can just wear on your vest like this or like this, depending on how you like it. Um, and you also have the drop belt. Uh, and you also have the drop belt solution. I like it. Um, and you also have the drop belt. Uh, and you also have the drop belt go. solution. I was going for that one. Nobody reacted to my plan of videos. Okay. Okay. But it's pretty cool. Now we also have some different up like it. I also
So is that a good idea to do it like this? Like the, the thing I explained with the videos? Or do you think, ah, just make one big video about it and that will take two hours? So I had one, but I didn't find one in stock. So I went for this one and maybe I will switch this out for the drop belt system uh, when I notice that this thing is really working. Now, and this attachment is one of the reasons why I bought the Swiss arms instead of the, and this pedal thing or connection type is one of the reasons why I bought this one. The most one of the reasons why I bought this one and not the water assault system because the water assault system has loops to wave into your mole and that's not the most, and that's not the sturdiest connection, especially if you use it on a belt. I want it to go through the inner belt, the most sturdiest part, and the warrior assault system universal holster just had molly loops and they went on the outside of the belt and that's not that sturdy as going through the and that not and that's not as sturdy as they went on the outside of the belt and that's not that sturdy as going through the and that not and that's not as sturdy as going and that's not as as sturdy as going through the of the belt and that's not as sturdy as going and that's not as sturdy as going through the middle of your belt. Belt that is the most sturdy part, like I said. Most sturdy part, like belt that is the most the middle of your belt. And that's not as sturdy as going through the middle of your belt. That is. Yeah, I said the thing twice. We don't need that. And maybe before, and maybe before we go any further. Uh, when you look at it, it's like a, I don't even know how to describe the color. It's not diarrhea, it's ugly. Let's call it ugly. This is ugly. And maybe before, and maybe before we go any further, and maybe before we go any further, maybe before, and maybe before we go any further, uh, when you look at it, let's see how that belt. And maybe before we go any further, uh, when you look at it, it's like a, I don't even know how to describe the color. It's not diarrhea, it's ugly. Let's call it ugly. This is ugly one. And all the colors they have, they are just so wrong. So this will be painted with some of my paint thingies. Um, so yeah, this one will be painted for sure. It will have my paint with some of my, so this will be painted with some of my paint so yeah, this one will be painted for sure. It will have, I don't know what yet. Let me check. Where is it? Where is it? No, there it is. I lost my Streamlabs screen. Uh, where was I? Oh yeah, the ugly part. So yeah, this one. But it's really ugly. It's it's really it, it really is. I don't even know how to describe the color. It's not diarrhea. It's ugly. Let's call it ugly. This is ugly one. And all the colors they have, they are just so wrong. So yeah, this one will be painted for sure. It will have I don't know what yet. Um, but this will be painted once I once I notice that it's working. And. Uh, this one will be painted when I notice that it's working and that it fits my gear because the colors are just, I don't know where they I already wrong. said that. So. Um, they have it in three colors. This is the, they have it in three colors. This is the OD version. They have the tan version and they, they also have a gray version. I don't think they have a black one, but yeah, both all of them, but yeah, both, but yeah, all of the curl, but yeah, all of all of the colors are like off so be aware of that if you buy one and you want to fit your gear without any modifications yeah no just paint it a little bit and it will fit perfectly i don't know that was a i, I thought that was the, i don't usually say that much bad things about the thing but that was just the colors are just off version i don't think they have a black one all of the colors are like off so be aware of that if you buy one and you want to fit your gear without any modifications yeah no just paint it a little bit and it will fit perfectly yeah, no. don't need 
delete that part. Now the release of the pit. Black, gray, OD. Well, but they have a tan version. Don't they? Hold on. Uh, adapt X tan. See, they have a tan. Ah, uh, four colors. But that doesn't. No, it's not that color. It is not. Okay, I have the olive. Okay. And I think this is the version 2, and you also have the version 3, and that was with the. I think the drop belt. Oh, it, it exists. I, I saw it. Level 3, level 3, level 3. See, that's with, that is with the drop bell thingy. That's the thing that I was, that, that I usually go for. I just have, I like to have my holster a little bit lower. But that's basically just a connection piece between this and the holster. So I have to find it, buy it, and uh, adapt it if I want to use it. Okay. Now the release of the pistol is. I will get the pistol. See my PJs. PJs. Oh, uh, where is my chat again? Okay. Now the next thing is the release of the pistol. I'm going to show you. If you put it in, it's a really snug fit. It will not go anywhere. And the release of the pistol is you have to press this little knob here, and you can remove the pistol out of it. Now I really like this system, uh, that's also one of the reasons that I went for this one and not the warrior assault system because you can remove the pistol out of it. No. Now the next thing is the release of the pistol. The dead. Now I really like this system, uh, that's also one of the reasons that I went for this one and not the warrior assault system because the other one, the assault, the warrior assault system has something, the other one, the assault the warrior assault system has something like a click thingy in the back back of the pistol and i don't like that i, I want to go over it I, I want to do it in one movement and yeah it didn't work for me on the warrior assault system thingy so i went so i really like this system and this is the thing it can switch from the other side that is still in the box for the left hand shooters and uh you can put it right in here it's yeah got it didn't work for me on the warrior assault system thingy so i went so I really like this system, and this is the thing it can switch from the other side that is still in the box. Was it here? I don't know. Only warrior assault system thingy. So I really like this system, and this is the thing it can switch from the other side that is still in the box for the left hand shooters, and uh, you can put it right in here. Okay, I didn't know that I was going to talk that much about it. <laughs> Actually, I always think like my videos will be eh, five minutes. Three minutes, four minutes. They never are. They never are. I never want to cut stuff. But I'm almost done here, I think. This is the end, the outro, I think. Now, the documentation says that it fits over 200 pistols. I, now, the documentation says that it fits almost. 200 pistols. I even read that it fits 300 pistols. I have a few pistols laying around and I will test um, how fast you can adjust it and if it works or not. I made a separate video about that. Uh, that's, uh, that's here. That's this, oh, this video. Like me showing different pistols. But I already lo lost a few parts. Uh, before I was able to make the video, uh, come on, shot. I have been. I lost two <laughs> screws already. Yeah. I tell the people in the video that super glue it. I didn't. And to do that, and I still didn't do that. And to do that, I will put everything back in as it came out of the box, um, because for this one, I had to remove. Uh, the small plastic ring to make it fit because this one is a little bit larger 
uh, but I will try to uh, put I will put it in the original configuration uh, it's a little bit larger uh, but I will try to uh, put I will put it in the original configuration and we will try out some pistols the first one I will just show the whole process and the next pistols I will just adjust it in my own time um, I will fast forward it and I will do it in my time I'll just adjust it in my own time um, I will fast forward it and I will do it in my time next pistols I will just adjust it in my own time um, I will fast forward it and do it in my time uh, I will not bother you times. by setting it up uh, and, and showing it on camera I will just do it here and then I will show you the end result so I'll show you that it works for different pistols that was a long talk about I will something do it in my time uh, I will not bother you by setting it talking about nothing next pistols I will just I will do it in my time uh, I will not bother you by setting it up uh, and, and showing it on camera I will just do it here and then I will show you the end result so I'll show you that it works for different pistols I even have a revolver that I want to test out I don't even know if that will work but we'll see and um, yeah we'll just go over to a montage that will show you all the pistols and how to adjust it here comes the montage I'm not going to do that right now that's something for a later stage Kablam. Um, so then I have to go to a, a zoomed camera. So I'm not going to record that right now. I need to do that in a minute. And I did that. Oh, more about that later. When the pistol slides in you, you can close the game. Can show me on the video. No, I can't show me. So who's going? Uh, who's going for Lisa's stream this evening? Now I already, now I already did some games with this pistol. Now I already did some games with the holster, and I really like it. And yeah, it does the trick as I hoped. Now I already did some games with this holster, and it really performs like I hoped it would perform. It stays in there. It doesn't wobble. It does the trick. Another cool feature is that it protects the pistol. Another cool thing about this halter is that it protects most of the pistol. If you go to the war assault system, it's not as high, so it protects less of the pistol. And because I jump around, slide over the ground, I want my pistols to be as protected as possible. Really important. All my gear, all my gear need to be as protected as possible. It does the trick. Another cool thing about now I paid, now some numbers, I paid 35 euros. I said that three so times. now some numbers, I bought 35. So now some numbers, I bought this for 30. You can see that I'm getting tired about recording stuff. I should take a break. Wait, it was, John, it was, oh my God, that delay is so bad. I, I need to fix, I will check if I can change that latency. I was able to set it up. But I don't know if I can change it when the stream is going. Next time I will um, put it on as short latency as possible to see if the quality is still good. By the way, how is the quality? Is it okay-ish? Is it 720? Is it 180? Is it bad? Um, and then with latency, I, I, the answer will be much faster. So I'm going to check it out. Wait, why? Okay, um, so it was six hours difference. So it's afternoon. No, it's it's three. It's uh, nine there, right? So now some numbers. I bought this for thirty-five euros. So now some numbers. I bought this for thirty-five euros. Like streaming on Twitch, I explained that to Panda why he asked me why I was on YouTube and not on Twitch. Okay, that's pretty good. That's okay. Um, he asked me why I was on, on YouTube and not Twitch because I want to keep my gaming and my airsoft a little bit separate. And I'm recording this now on the channel where my videos are coming on. So if somebody... Uh, okay. When somebody is um, 
enjoying what they see and they want to see more about the videos that I'm talking about, they can just subscribe to the channel immediately. Otherwise, they ha you have to make them switch platforms from Twitch to YouTube. But I'm still, like, gaming is, is going to be on my Twitch. I'm not going to game on my YouTube channel. YouTube is everything Airsoft related and my Twitch is just gaming related. I hope that makes sense. Okay, 34.9 euros, and I bought it from Airsoft Shop. Um, so yeah, it's it's around the same price as most of my holsters. I am more a fan of the um, all-in-one holsters, but uh, I don't have to do that now, right? So now some numbers. I pay 35 euros for this holster. So now some numbers. I pay 35 euros for this holster. All right, 35. So now some numbers. I pay 35 euros for this holster. All right, 34.9, but uh, so 35 euros, depending on the shop that you buy it from. So now some. Oh, uh, Connie, I know that you can like do it on both channels, but I don't think I hate that. Then you have to check out two streams. Two, you have to grow two channels for the things uh, nah. I just like to have it separated to be as protected as possible so now some numbers I pay 35 euros for this holster all right 34.9 but 35 euros depending on the shop that you buy it from I bought this from airsoft shop and I'm really uh, happy with the price uh, for the holster that I got now if you're looking for a universal holster that fits uh, a lot of pistols I really recommend this one it's an easy setup it does the trick I'm more a fan of the one holster for a pistol type thingy because then I know it has a snug fit and I don't lose little parts. But this one is a good one if you have different pistols laying around and you don't want to switch your holsters all of the time. But keep in mind that the screws that you glue them because you don't want to lose them if you want to set it up. Yeah, by doing that on, on like different channels, it's just weird. You have to keep in mind, you have to check both chats, you have to... I know you, you, you reach more people on it and more people can get to your content, but I don't know. <laughs> Delta fell out of the <laughs> sofa. I just heard dunk, dunk, dunk. Weird dog. Multiple times. It's not the best ID to get a holster like this. I don't know how it is with the universal holster from Warrior Assault System, but this one I would leave it in this configuration, use it for a long time, and then maybe if I have a new pistol, I can change the configuration again. See, that is a long part, and I I'm happy with it. Now, if you're looking for a universal holster that fits, and that 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 shows. The more you practice the things, the more you do stuff that you get better at it. And all the things that I do to create the videos, slowly getting myself better to, to um, yeah, it's, it's slowly improving everything that I do. I'm not saying that I'm good at it. I'm just happy with the slow pace that it's going forward. Now, if something happens or I, I come to an update of this holster, I will post a new video about it. Uh, but as it looked like for now, I use it, I'm happy with it, and I will keep using it. And if you know any other universal holsters that does this thing that as this one, just let me know in the comments because I only knew because I only found just let me know in the comments because I only knew because I only found two or three holsters and one was not worth looking at as this one. Just let me know in the comments because be that's also why I need to talk slower so I can cut easily. Because I want to comment because I only found two or three holsters and one was not worth looking at. Um, and those were the two that I found. So if you have another holster that fits a lot of pistols, just leave me something in the comments and I will take a look at it. Okay, I got when I talked about it with people, somebody gave me like. Oh, I got a holster that fits so many pistols. And then he showed me, yes, it does fit a lot of 1911 pistols. But I, no, it doesn't fit that many pistols. 
can you fit a Glock in it? No. Like, no, you don't fit a lot of holster. You don't fit a lot of pistols. It fits a lot of 1911 and 1911 clones, but not a lot of pistols. Also, this video is a part of the gear that I use and that I like using because I make videos about the gear that I use. If you want to see more videos about the gear that I'm using in videos or in, um, and if you want to see more videos about the gear, videos about the gear that I use. If you want to see more videos about the gear that I'm using in videos or in, uh, and if you want to see more videos about the gear that I'm, I'm using in my Nilsen videos or. Uh, in my gameplay videos, just go to my channel. There is a link. That I will link it here above, so you can find all the videos of my gear. Self promotion. So you can find all the videos of my gear. So you can find all the videos of my gear. So you can find all the videos of my gear. I don't know what. Ah, oh, yes, I know why I did that. Every six days, or every six days, every six days, I. I have a drawer with holsters. <laughs> and every six days I post a new video about something that I do in Airsoft. If you want to keep up to date, consider subscribing to the channel. Wait, wait, wait. I hate that. And every six days I launch a new video about something that I do in Airsoft. This can be Milsim related, this can be a gameplay video or just a gear video. Uh, and if you want to keep up to date, consider subscribing to the channel. But for now I'm going... But for now I'm going... Even the ending. I can't do the ending. But for now, I want to wish you a very good day, and I'll see you all next week for a new video. Bye. Bye. <laughs> yes, I time myself because every 29 minutes my camera stops recording, so I have to time it. Video about something that. I and every six days. Okay. 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 I can. Uh... You can find all the videos of. Okay. I think we're done. This is the first edit part that is done. That's the boring part. That's like cutting everything into pieces. Cut my video into pieces. This is my final result. No, it's not. I have to edit some more stuff on it in it. Uh, nine minutes. Yeah, it's under ten minutes, but ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, I need to. <laughs> To the montage so i think it will be Sports over 10 minutes pistols. i even have a revolver that i want to test out i don't even know it. now i already did some games with this holster and i don't even know if that will work but we'll yeah we'll just go over to a montage that will show you it's fitting here i'm going to put a text on it that, that's just a reminder for me because when i something comes up wait why is I see that is a you thing, isn't it? If it records longer, it's considering a video camera and text changes or something. I have no idea. I th it's the first thing that I, that I heard that that that's the limit. I just thought that it was uh, because I have no idea why because the technical capabilities of the the, the DSLRs because you can use it for streaming like if I can put it like right over there I can have like awesome quality webcam footage but I don't do that because I don't want to set it up constantly and breaking it down this is a pretty good webcam now um, but I have no idea that that might be the reason why it's not it's technically still a photo camera but they make movies with it anyway, so I have no idea. But that's a good question. I know a guy that makes videos and movies. I'm gonna ask him about that. I'm gonna if I asked him and I got an answer I will let you know. Montage. Okay. Um what's the time? How long have I been streaming? Okay, I can do the montage. I think I, that will be rather fast. Huh.
The new EU rule states that any digital still camera with a resolution higher than and, and duration of video of 30 minutes or more must now be classified as a video camera recorder and hence be taxed as at a higher rate. Huh. So that might be why I think Nikon doesn't have that much or that good video thingies. But with, with, with the Canon, it's classified as a video camera because you can go up to 4K now. <sighs> Legislation, rules, sometimes they're not the smartest people, but I don't know. So a GoPro is also a, yeah, that's, that's a video camera thing. Huh. Interesting. Thank you. I learned something today. Pretty good. Sorry if Gail, Gail is still here. Um, so I did this. Gonna keep it on the Hello Kitty, on the Hello Kitty one. Hello Kitty. That's Lisa's pistol, by the way. Audio. Need the second one. Okay. Now match it up matter that much because I'm not really talking but I want it like have it as perfect as possible I think you just want to have some laws going for you EU in some cases it's a good thing the HK oh hello kitty is pretty it's a custom Hello Kitty that was made by a friend of Lisa. I think a lot of the pistols are Lisa. Uh, that's me still trying to fix it. Uh. <laughs> it's not mine. It's not mine. I also would run it, but it, still it's not mine. It's a gift that Lisa got from, from a friend that's not playing anymore. Uh, like this one is mine. I got that from Lisa for my birthday. And then Lisa had one of the cool ones. Where is it not? For people that, for people that have been playing for a long time, this is a Western Arms. This is like, I think that was one of the most expensive pistols that you could have at that day. I think that was 200 euros for a pistol. Uh, and she also has this one. Is it on it? No. This one. That's a Tokyo Mari non-blowback hardballer. I don't even know what time, when that one came out. Uh, let's check that. Tokyo Mari Hard Baller Non Blowback. <laughs> Do they still make it? Two days in five. No, 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 no. This one. What? What the fuck? People are asking five hundred US dollars for it. Damn, bro. That's true, that's true. But a lot of the gear you can use, I'll, I'll try to keep my gear as cheap as possible for the things that I do. But even then, 
yeah, it's getting really expensive fast. I don't know, I can cut this. Okay, that was the, that's the first. Step. Okay, okay, did I just send it? Also, by with airsoft, <laughs> um, I think I must disagree. Um, depending on the drugs, it might be more expensive. But like a lot of the gear that you have in airsoft, you can also use for camping, and that's a big plus. For example, I saw a picture of Ace going to the zoo with his family, and he wore his his his, his backpack. So it's not that you use you you buy one thing and you can only use it for airsoft a lot of the airsoft gear that you buy you can use it in your daily life uh, if you want to buy a fancy truck like Yana is doing now he can buy it he can use that for his dogs he can use it for whatever other purpose i think that that's pretty cool on the stuff that you buy for airsoft the guns and and the holsters and the gear uh the chest tricks and, and all that yeah that's specific for the game but a lot of the gear you can use in a lot of different ways. Pants, shoes, uh, lights, um, food, a lot of the stuff is it's reusable. Well, not reusable, but flexible to use in different ways. Yeah. And it got better with the years. In the beginning, you had like the most expensive one and the cheap ones. And there was almost nothing in between. I, I, that's, but, well, um, I know, um, uh, I think it's Oscar, Hari, and I don't know who else, they are using their plate carriers for training, so they go running with it, they do obstacle courses, uh, with their plate carriers, they don't have pouches on it, but they use the plate carriers as weighted vests, and I have seen a lot of, like, players, or even sports people, uh, sports people using weighted vests for training because the ones that you can buy in the the sports shop they just suck and plate carriers are well designed so why not use it as a weighted vest for your exercises so now I'm going to make it fit for the other models I have this one Is a um, so now I'm going to make it fit for the other models. I, I will cut that. Uh, out. This one. We don't need that. Uh, I have this one. It is a. Uh, no, 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 no! I don't need to do it like that. I think I will. Hmm, fast war forward it. I think that will be the yeah, yeah, that will be the way to go. But can I do that? Three time controls? Will you change speed? Ah, I think maybe it's best if I just cut it. Yeah, that will be yeah, that will be better. I will just cut it and then change the speed. That will be easier. And in airsoft gear, if you go to the more expensive gear like night visions and uh, real deal stuff, yeah, then it really gets expensive. I have this one. Is a um, and then I'm fast forwarding, adjusting, adjusting. That to show the pistol, to show you inserting the pistol into the holster. Then, yeah, I, I was that was the first idea, but I don't know. If it's 
better if I just fast forward it. Like, now I ha then you can see how to fiddle with it. Okay, right, I, I remember what I did. I tried to fix it, but I, I couldn't fix it because the screws were too short. And then I said what I was going to do, but... Uh, I will just cut here. Do an overlay with the name of the pistol. Yeah, I will do that. Like at the bottom, I will show the pistol. We'll cut around here. Nobody will notice. And then uh, still adjusting up to here. And I, the idea was to do this at, let's see, 800%. Let's see how fast that is. Oh, hmm. Sound. Do we need the sound? We don't need the sound. But it's connected to the sound. <laughs> Chain speed, 800%. Okay, that one up. It will be a little bit more work, but uh, we, will, we can handle it. Let's do this, and then I'm gonna do John's thing that he suggested. I have this one. This is a um, an overlay. That's it. That's. That was the ID. Now we're gonna do John's ID, like this. I have this one. This is a, um... Okay, let me know when, what, what you like most. I'm gonna put it right here so I know where it fits. Let me know what you like the most. And I'm switching to the different one. And I might even do like a ding when it fits. Every time controls, 100%. Do 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 The next one. Hi, Bard. How you doing? Looking forward to Bellum. That was an easy fit.
how is the back going? I think Wim told me something that you had trouble with your back. How is it going? Or was it your knee? I, I can't. I, I just remember that you were injured. And how is it going? Oh, that was fast. But yeah, because it's a nine, 1911, and those fit. If one fits, they all fit. Awesome, Bart. Totally ready to rock and roll in Sweden, right? This, this can go. <laughs> did you fell off your boat? How did you do that? <laughs> How do you break to... How? I'm gonna do it 400%, otherwise I will not have anything left anymore. No, it was a joke. <laughs> oh, in the storm. Wait, do you... Do you have a big boat where you go in open water with? I thought you were only like going on the channel and, and the slow water. How is the boat doing, by the way? Oh, you were caught in like two weeks back. Where were you? Was it in Belgium? Sorry for the interrogation. Interrogation. It just has been a, a long time since we we've seen each other. We usually just we meet up a couple of times to play airsoft, but because of Corona, we couldn't do that. So now we have to talk about it. We can talk like this. Hey! Hey! Where's my, where's my footage? Where is my footage? I think I moved it up. Huh? All right, my my camera stopped recording. Ah, uh, yeah, people tell me that. <laughs> What the hell am I? Oh, oh, I remember. My card is full. That's why I'm yelling. But I have to line it up again. That's... Oh, you were in the harbor while well, well, it happened. Damn. Were you like 
controlling everything if everything was okay because you are the harbor master if that is the right term so you have to take care of everything that every boat is secured and stuff like that so you might have had a, a really busy time with all the bad weather stuff like if it rains so much can it affect like all the water that goes into a boat and, and damage the boat because like you think a boat is on water it, it can stand the rain but if, if it rains that much it might damage it or get full I don't know and sink because of the weight of the water I don't know anything about boats it might be like being crazy Snake is that Netherlands? Looking it up. Snake. Yeah, it's the Netherlands. Awesome boy. That's pretty cool. That's like chill. That's one thing that I like about boats. It's so chill. Maybe someday I'll get a boat when I have time. Go have fun with the chickens, John. Thank you for uh, coming back. Okay, oopsie, whoopsie. I think we can delete this. Let's see how it goes. No, 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 no. This is when it happens. I had to switch cameras. Well, I had to switch cards because one was full. And now the audio doesn't line up. So I, I, I got a split in between. And yeah, uh, sucks. But I can use that split. I'm gonna do it like this, and I'm gonna speed this up. Eight hundred percent. Why didn't you? Okay, I'm gonna delete this then. How long? How long were you on the boat, Bart? Because that's not the fastest boat you got but it's like a pleasure boat I don't, <laughs> I don't know if I say that right a pleasure boat oh okay I need to every time control this to change 800 Now I delinked them. Now I can move everything up again. Oh, sh sh now I'm gonna cut this. We don't need that. Just showing off the pistol. Yup. Oh yeah. Yes, it's a lot of work. But it's a thing that I like to do. I like to make videos that show um, like the stuff that I use so people see what I'm using. But yes, it is a lot of work. But for me, this is relaxing. And now with the, the stream going on, I have some people that are here with me and then I can meet up with people like you. You saw that I was uh, streaming and you, you jumped in the stream and now we can talk about your boat and, and that's pretty cool. It takes a little bit longer to edit it but I gladly take the uh, companionship from friends that you haven't seen for a long time. And as, as long as this is not like a chat going like bananas, I can 
slowly edit things <clears throat> like this is not that you don't have to think about it too much um, but now I have to think oh there it is 800 percent okay like this is already 31 yeah I even might have to make it I have this one shorter this is a um How is it with C C? <laughs> I was like, what the, what the hell? Does he mean ICS? <laughs> uh, Lisa's doing fine. She she went on a trip to the Netherlands with her mom, and now she's back home. She's taking a nap. Yeah, I can cut that right here. But she's doing fine. She it's, it's a fucked up time, but she's doing pretty well. She's taking a lot of responsibility on fixing everything. So yeah, she's really proud of her. I'm always proud of her. And we have been together today for 12 years. And we still have some cake left from our wedding. And we're going to eat that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 12 years. 12 years all right don't need this next pistol the hardballer fast forward is a bit like boring work because I know how I want to do it I know how I want to make it look but you have to go through the process that's also it, it, it's part of the video we next pistol thank god I don't have 40 pistols that I tested out thank you but yes there is a big delay on um, the, the stream. I will check if, if I can do it less next time. The ICS XFG. Still my favorite pistol. Just love it. Well, because it's a lot fatter than the other pistols. All the wiggling, a little bit of wiggling, yes, perfect. Going to eight hundred percent. I don't even know if, if if I'm going to keep it in. It might be that it's too long to keep it in, but it really shows how strong and how adaptive this holster is. If you don't put it in, I just say. Oh, it can take a lot of pistols. I don't know. It adds to the credibility of the video by showing it like this. My opinion. My opinion. And for the people that are watching this, uh, I don't know if you saw my latest video about the airsoft types. That is, if you didn't see it, just take a look at it and give me your opinion about it. Because it's, it's a topic that I want to discuss with other people. Not just make videos about it, show it, and, and that's it. No, I really want to open up a conversation about that. The Hello Kitty one.
Enjoy your boat ride, Bart. Thank you all. Thank you for joining in on the on the stream. Um, I will think I'll be thinking about you because I can imagine that taking a boat ride right now. Yeah, I would enjoy having that slow pace, boat going forward, enjoying the wind or whatever. Just enjoy the the silence and the whatever. Enjoy it, boy. Enjoy it. Man, not boy. Man. How many pistols do I have to go? I know this is not the most fun thing to watch, but if you have a question, just let me know so I can answer the question while I'm doing this boring work. Okay, at least I might get afraid now. It just start. Um, thunder, lightning, thunderstorm. She doesn't like thunder. Are you silver? No. Am I done with it? There she is, boys and girls. Was not the smartest idea to show with you. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Cole. Hi. Well, Ben, I have to be busy. Ben, can I the last six weeks come on here and then come on over here? And yeah, great. It. And then we have to go above and come. Ja, maar ik ben even moet nog het laatste monteren, maar ook aan het stream. Maar deze moet nog een paar pistolen doen. Uh, ik kan nog een keer Ja, we nog een pistool of twee, drie. En toen kan ik naar beneden komen. Oké? Okay? Bye. Alright, Lisa called to tell me the to ask me if I can go down on her. Haha, <laughs> no no. If I if I can go down because it's starting to uh probable thunder whatever uh, so i will finish this part and i will go down on her <laughs> no i will just go down so john did you what's your opinion because you told me to just cut it out the part where i'm adjusting it but do you think it's necessary or do you think, ah, it's fucking boring, just cut out that part, nobody wants to see how you fiddle around with it? Or do you think it's a good idea to just leave it in there? I just want to have your opinion, or anyone's opinion. I don't know who else is here. I think that's the last one. One of my favorite. Stop that. <clears throat> stop what? What do I have to stop? I hate the delay. Oh, look at this fancy. Awesome, John. Thank you. So I'll keep it in there. Um, change speed 800%. We're almost done with this part. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Hi, Gail. Welcome back. We're almost done for today. Um, I want to finish this part off and then I will end the stream for today. And um, 
and then I have to add the uh, close-ups into it. I'm not going to stream that because otherwise I'll just ruin everything and you will we don't need that. I will um, do that on my own time and then uh, when the video launches I think Okay, 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 I will stop it. <laughs> I will go I will go downstairs to check on Lisa. <laughs> right? Let me just put it in there. We can remove this, we can delete this. Paste it on it and see how it looks. I have this one. A, um, I will put some music on it. Okay. I will cut a little bit here. We don't need the fiddling anymore. Gone. Done. You played some badminton and your allergies? Are you allergic to badminton? I don't know what mu music yet. I have to decide. Hold on. I think I can eh, audio. Can do it real fast. Uh, data, nope. Documents. Stock. Music. Uh, funny, 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 funny. Happy. Campfire. Seventies porn. I think I can do that, even. Uh, but where is it? Eighties <laughs> porn music. There it is. You're allergic to your own sweat, Gail. Damn, that sucks. did some games with this holster and it really performs like I hoped it would perform. It stays in there, it doesn't wobble, it does the trick. Another cool thing about this holster is that it protects most of the pistol. If you go to the water assault system, it's not as high, so it protects. Pouch, wow, wow. There you go, and that will be it for today. I have been editing for, how long? Uh, almost two hours. Okay, I, I almost finished the video. 
think the video will be 11, well, I will be around here. So 11 minutes, almost 11, yeah. That's good, it's good length. Talk about eight. <laughs> Oh yes, it does. Okay, um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, don't forget Lisa streaming tonight. Uh, go hop over on her stream and say hi to her. Um, but um, yeah, thank you all for watching. And um, I will do another uh, editing stream really fast because I have a new video upcoming with my new, well, not new, with my custom chess rig with the 60s Shikong, Shikom, Shikom, I don't know how to pronounce it, with Molly things on the side that Lisa made for me. So pretty cool chest trick. Um, but yes, um, shutting this down for today and um, see you all next time for a new stream.